All right, so that's not very promising. There was a warning saying this game would be disturbing. So, I guess welcome to Um Fend. Um Fend. I'm not really sure what this means. Mm, uh, I don't know. The name kind of reminds me of Unfriended. I don't know if it has anything to do with Unfriended, though. I guess we're just jumping in now. Oh, well, wow. I'm already, like, moving around and stuff. Find batteries, water the plant, bring the seed, pour the fleer? Does that say pour the fleer? Bring the I don't know, I think the the words are all messed up. Crystal emitting strange waves, many charged particles. Fleer don't drink it. Huh, I don't know what a fleer is. Can I pick up this flashlight? Guess not. Water the plant. It's being filled with fleer. Okay, that's the batteries. It needs batteries. Oh, okay, so there's more batteries. All right, let's just let's just keep that music on. Okay, so that's being filled to fleer whatever that means. Put the seed. Okay. Is this a battery? I thought I just saw something glowing, but I guess not. Kind of an unsettling silence. That's probably the point. The graphics are a bit rough around the edges. It's kind of a, I don't know, throwing my vision off a little bit. Should I open this door? Hey, some more batteries. Oh, I'm guessing that's the seed. Can't open that door. So pretty much we can only interact with glowing objects, it looks like. Okay, we just turned our lights on. Got some water. So this is kind of like a point and click adventure game. Another battery. Oh. Okay, filled the glass with water. I don't know what that is. Okay, so I can't really click on my inventory at all. So we're just going to use stuff when we get to use it, I guess. I thought this was a horror game. 
It doesn't really feel like it's a horror game, though. So I don't know. I think I might have messed up with this one. Let's go ahead and open this door. No. Hey, don't tell me no. I'll open this damn door if I want to. I guess I'm not going to open it. Okay. Let's put these batteries in. Okay, that's cool. Okay, let's pour the flea or whatever that... Is this supposed to be flour? Maybe this person can't spell. Pour the flour makes sense. Alright, what's going on? Oh, maybe we have to push this button over here. Um, I don't like this. Oh shit. Okay, yeah, this probably is a horror game. Uh, damn it. Oh, no. Ah, uh, I don't, I don't like this at all. I think there's something in the house with us. Okay, that was simple enough. Mm. Nope, still can't go through that door. Somebody really doesn't want us to go in there. It's a pretty great painting. I I would really like that painting on my wall too, to be honest. Yeah, I, I still don't I still don't know what's going on here. The parts are gone. Well, that's that's some bullshit. Ooh, I'm here. I will return you to restore the cable, the cable, the core model, battery, the crystal. We have time to talk. Okay. So, uh, whatever's going on. They seem to know us. Oh, man. Why are we allowed to turn that light off? Oh, I hear some ominous. It's getting louder. Yeah, I, I definitely see something moving in that corner over there. Looks like a person. Ooh, man. And 
They really like turning lights off. Can I turn the lights back on? Is there even a reason to be in this room right now? Oh, nice. This door that wasn't open before is now open. Okay, got the cable. Huh. Time. All right. Why? Okay, I'm guessing it's haunted. We let some kind of spirit in. Maybe we should start acting like the guys from Ghost Adventures. Why are you hurting us? Who are you? Why are you here? What? What are you doing here? Oh man! Oh man. That's not cool. Why'd you do that to us? Why are you hurting us? Okay. Yeah, I, I definitely don't like this. Awesome, the power is out. Can we restart the power again? Guess not. Nope, they still don't want us to use that. For a minute there, it looked like we could pick something up, but I guess not. The cable is restored. Alright, who's laughing? Can I not pick up a... Well, this light's still on. I don't really want to go out here. getting pretty ominous again. Nah, still won't let us in. I was just checking. Okay, I guess we're going in the kitchen. And 
and I don't think there's actually anything in the kitchen. Ooh. Something on the TV, though. That's cool. There's just... The TV is showing us... So, do we go... Well, now we can't even go in there. I had to check. Well, the lights are back on in the kitchen. Somebody left the faucet running. Better turn that off. It's kind of careless. Ooh, okay. Somebody was just at the window. And they really like turning lights off. Whoa. Did you remember? Hmm. It's that weird spirit matter looking stuff again. I guess it could be leaves. Yep, it's probably leaves. What is it that we need to remember? No, no. I, I had to check. All right. That's cool. Oh, you were nice enough to bring the power back on. Thanks, man. Okay, I guess we're hunting for batteries now. Those batteries... That battery wasn't there before, though. Unless I'm just, like, going crazy or something. No batteries in the bathroom. Just making sure. Covered all ground. The door to the lab is open again. I, I, I mean, I think it's a lab. I only found one battery, though. I'm not even going to try to open the door again because I already know we can't open it. Is there a light switch? Battery connected. Okay, so there's only one battery this time. What do we need to do now? Do we need to pour more FLIR? Whatever FLIR is. I'm Anita. Who's Anita, though? Or am... Yes, yeah, is Anita. Must be somebody from the main character's past. Oh. Anita, you're not welcome here. I'm sorry. I'm just trying to pour some flair into some stuff and make seeds do something. I really want to open that door now. This isn't good. I'm gonna go hide in the bathroom. Oh, I don't like this. Yeah, and there's like an old, there's like a rotted heart. I guess it's not rotted.
Okay, so why is this important? Not even going to shut the fridge, are we? I'm just going to leave the fridge open with this beating heart here. Oh man, now there's flashing going on. If I never find out what's behind this door, I'm going to go crazy. Ah, oh, cool, we're shut in. And, ooh. Okay. Okay, lots of bugs crawling out of the vent. That's not a good sign. We're gonna have to call the termite inspector. Still can't open the door. Okay, what just happened? Oh, who are you? Don't you remember me? Tell me, who are you? The girl you ignored at school. At school? I've been beside you for 11 years. What do you want from me? You don't remember me at all. At all. There were articles about me in newspapers, like I read newspapers. I always dreamed that you would look my way. I wanted you to pay attention to me. All right. I'm gonna try to see if we can open this door one more time. No. We cannot. Okay, I still feel like there's stuff we're missing. Did this girl, like, kill herself because we didn't notice her? Like, a lot of these games have been about suicide here lately. Empty. Her heart's empty? Is that, is this like a metaphor? There was a heart in the fridge. Did she like cut her own heart out or some crazy shit like that? No, still can't use that door. All right, so what's important about that empty, empty box over there? Can 
we turn the TV back on? What What is it that we can do? Do we need to go into the bathroom again? There's something in there. And of course we can't turn the lights off. Hmm. Looks like the bathtub has probably got blood in it. The core module. Yep, some bugs. Mm. This honestly kind of reminds me of Silent Hill, The Room, a little bit. Just because we're stuck in this apartment building. I mean, you got to leave the apartment building a little bit in that game. But the, the apartment aspect, being confined in this space, kind of reminds me of that game. Do we finally get to go through this door? No. I, I'm seriously, like, really wanting to know what's behind that door now. Okay, so it's just open now. Connected. Okay, so... I know we're still missing something. Will you return to me? What do you mean by return to you? You think I forgot? Okay, lady. I, I. What if you have the wrong person? How can I return to you if I never went to you in the first place? Alright. Nope. I'm starting to get a little bit annoyed. Bathroom's clean now, so I mean, at least you 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 clean your up after yourself. So I mean, like that's that's pretty nice of you. You actually seem like a pretty cool undead ghost person. The heart box is not here anymore. How? What is this supposed to mean? So... They want us to die. They don't seem like a very nice ghost now. Ooh, man. Even when things are getting all weird, distorted, you won't let me use that door. Yeah, it's definitely nothing like Unfriended.
Okay, what am I supposed to be doing? Am I supposed to find this clock? Oh. Whoa. All right. So that was a little weird. Hmm, it's getting all jumpy. Lagging on me. I'm sure it's intentional though. Nah, still no. Great. And let me guess, the lab's gonna be open now. No? Is there something in here that we... Mmm. Alrighty. The bathroom now teleports us into this lab now. I need to launch it. Alright. Let's launch this again. I still don't really know what we're doing here. And this portal thing is messing up again. Acting up, doing some weird stuff. Again? Oh man, at this point I would just give up, because... Flashlight's not working now. Do I need to approach the portal? Oh wow, this is kind of a nice change of scenery. Are we in like a schoolyard? 1996, so we've gone back in time 11 years. Just like uh, Anita had mentioned, it's been 11 years because it said 2005. I'm guessing this is the school. Still don't quite understand the title of the game. Why is it called Um Fend? Uh, I didn't know you had to ring. Hello? Okay, I have no clue what happened. But, I mean, at least this one was really a horror game so I don't know uh, I guess I'll leave a link to the game in the description so you can play it for yourselves and I guess I'll just leave it here I'm not really sure what else to say about this game it, it was pretty interesting it was weird it was definitely more of a horror game than the last couple that we've played but I mean, even though I didn't know what the heck was going on, I did like it. It was kind of comparable to Silent Hill in some ways. I mean, not really, because we weren't, like, fighting anything, but it had that weird kind of trippy, kind of hallucinating sort of stuff going on. But it, I guess all in all, it was pretty 
it was a pretty nice little experience. So thank you for watching, and I hope to see you next time.